Hello Light Anchors, I'm Courtney, and I'm starting this YouTube channel to help. And if you feel helped by what I'm saying, then yay, because that was the whole point. I'm just going to jump off the deep end and hope it works out. So I would say my awakening began three years ago on the worst day of my life. Before that, I was not who I am now. <clears throat> and without going into too much detail, my f favorite dog and best friend and fuzzy soulmate died. It was horrible. And in that year of grieving, things began to change and weird things began to happen. And I found really awesome people on YouTube that kind of got me through it. And now, three years later, I'm still trying to figure it out, but things are different now in the way that I'm living more as me and less as who everyone else wants me to be. And today I would like to discuss being yourself. And for some reason, it's really hard to just be who you are, really, on the inside. Everyone always wants you to be the same and think the same thoughts and look like everyone else. And for some people, or all of us, really, that's not who we are. We're individuals. And I guess the key to being yourself is to just stop caring what everyone thinks. And just be you no matter what anyone says. Or if people look at you weird because they will. <laughs> but to me... Being who I am and looking how I want to look makes me more happy than being a zombie and going with the flow, just like everyone else. I mean, it didn't happen overnight. I've made like little changes here and there and then... The more I be me, the more I want to be me, so I just keep making more changes to be that. And some days, it's annoying. The looks, the whispers, whatever. But at the end of the day, I'm the one that still has to be okay with who I am. And if I'm not being me, then I didn't do the best job I could, and to me, that's not okay. I like to take long pauses and think about stuff, which I guess doesn't really work in a video. <laughs> but if you can change your inside thoughts to stop putting you down, then you can definitely block out what other people think or say or their views on you. They're going to have their own opinions. That's not going to change, but you don't have to listen 
you don't have to keep hiding who you are because of their opinion of how you should be. I'm a weirdo. I've always been a weirdo. That's never going to change, no matter whose opinion is directed my way. Anyway, <clears throat> that's all I can think of right now. Be the weirdos you know you are on the inside. Because at the end of the day, it's going to make you happy, and that's the whole point. So, Carpe Lumen, friends. I'll see you next time.